Okay, so don't be shocked when you see me on the screen. There we are. I'm on the lower <laughs> right corner of the screen. So it can only mean one thing. That's right. Odd one out it is officially called odd one out now. Um, so uh, I don't know what I'm going to do to the thumbnail, but maybe if I'm not lazy, if I remember, I'll switch it over. Or I'll make some edit. <laughs> some sort of edit uh welcome to the stream um yes two things going on tonight we're gonna watch some odd men outs and then we're gonna play umineko um we'll probably watch i've queued up three episodes of odd one out because i have to try so hard not to say odd man out uh odd one out I've queued three episodes because I'm so excited. We are back in person. No more COVID production uh, episodes or whatever here, as far as I can tell. If you, if you watched any of the previous in-person episodes versus the Zoom ones that we had been slogging through, it feels like the, just the in-person ones hit differently. So... Uh, that's what we're gonna do. Like I said, three episodes I got queued up, however long that takes. I'm just so excited, honestly. In person, they just hit differently. Um, try not to burp on mic here. Um, since this is the introduction of the new season of Odd One Out, and we're in person, I'll, I'll summarize exactly our, um, our, uh how we watch it here on this channel so we watch along uh, we get introduced to all the characters i pick one that i think is the mole i lock in my answer and then one person gets eliminated usually one person gets eliminated i then pick a second person i lock in and that's my two choices and then at the end of the episode i win if i if my person if one of my two picks were the mole. That's how we do it here. Uh, looks like we're going to get a Ridge Wallet sponsorship now. Also the rules, since I'm using their <laughs> their videos and mine, uh, I'll let their baked in ads uh, stand. Hey good humans, Jason from Jubilee here at the Jubilee office. Just want to take a moment to say thank you to the Ridge because Wallet Because I'm a good person. Episode. It only feels right, right? I honestly just got this wallet, and I think he it's honestly incredible. just got the wallet. It looks super dope, really, really sleek. Super dope. Super I'd say that too. Also really, really durable. Maybe not about it's the ridge wallet, but just saying the word dope. Time warranty. I don't know. Hold up to twelve cards. I I don't have necessarily a problem with the minimalist wallets like this. I just like the more traditional looking trifold wallets, which I use to this day. But that's just like out of habit. I'm a I'm a person of habit. Which is a big concern sometimes I have with thin wallets and has space for your cash as well. Uh, I highly recommend it. I've loved carrying it around. They've got over 30 different options for colors. Uh, you can have 30 options. Fiber, burnt titanium. I honestly love it so much. I make it a second one just so I can kind of switch out through the colorways. There's also even a 45 day guarantee. So if you get it and you don't love it, you can always send it back. I feel unnecessary. So I don't think you should buy two. Use to just switch Google, up the colorways like that. Off. Well, Make sure you check them out. who am I to complain? The corner, this could be the who am I to? Father, or honestly yourself, or your mother. Anyone, really. Uh, make sure you check out Ridgewell. Thank you again for the sponsorship. And we hope you enjoy this episode. Oh, so I will. Artist off the top of your head that you like. Maybe not idolize, oh, but I... look up to. Shit, I should have said. Um, The episode here, if you, you can read it here. Six makeup artists versus a fake. Also, we've got uh, six uh, little wizard fans, and uh, there's like a bug flying around my face. Oh, God. And then um, six cheerleaders versus a fake. Also, you can see that I pulled up my watch later and just pulled them into here <laughs> because uh, I think I talked about this last time. Last time we were watching Odd, Odd, Odd Man slash One Out, they like fucked up their playlists to like an obnoxious degree. Uh, make sure you check out Red Fucking Fuck, I'm a gnat around my head, dude. 
Who's a makeup artist off the top of your head that you like, maybe not idolize, but you look up to? Be Neil. Neil. Manny. <laughs> <laughs> that was amazing. We brought together seven makeup artists. I am a makeup artist. I'm a makeup artist. I am a makeup artist. I'm a makeup artist. I'm a makeup artist. I'm a makeup artist. I am a makeup artist. There's seven. Okay, so this that's all I get. I'm gonna go through slowly. I already think someone isn't a makeup artist just by that intro. I'm a makeup artist. I am a makeup. I think she's a makeup artist. I'm a makeup. I think he's a makeup artist. I am. I don't think Nikki's a makeup artist. I think if anything, the look is supposed to try to throw us off. I'm gonna my lock in. My number one vote is Nikki. Lock it in. Kachink sound effect. I'm a makeup artist. I'm a makeup artist. Mariah. I'm a makeup artist. I'm a makeup artist. I am a makeup artist. One is a liar. If the group I have some thoughts about my next one. Split a cash prize. Oh, we got some updated graphics. Oh man. Oh, we're really in this shit right now. If the liar survives, they win the entire prize. Who is the odd one out? No longer odd man out. Silent round? Oh, we get a one minute long silent round? Oh, I'm not gonna learn anything then. Mm. I was just like staring at everyone, trying to see who was staring at each other. And I was like kind of confused at first of what was going on. I kind of assumed that everybody would be coming in with a full face of makeup. So when Aldrich came in and he didn't have any specific eye look, I'm kind of thinking, huh, maybe he doesn't really do makeup. I don't know. That seems unnecessary. I know there's like... Like, if you're, like, um, a tattoo artist without any tattoos, there's, like, a, for lack of a better term, like, a stigma to it. But, like, this seems, I, I'm going, I'm showing up to the imaginary box of Odd One Out. I don't need to have full face of makeup to prove I am a makeup artist. Makeup. You know what I mean? It seems like you're trying too hard. This is weird. The minute long silent round, I don't know if I like that. Also, what are they supposed to do? How are you supposed to eliminate someone here? I felt like everyone was gonna eliminate me right away just because I was definitely a bit extra. <laughs> They're all voting differently. To me, it didn't really seem like a professional. It seemed like someone who was just trying to experiment with everything that they had in their kit. Damn it, Mariah was gonna be my second choice. I mean, I can still vote for her, but. Oh, okay, bye guys. <laughs> I'm looking at body reactions as she gets eliminated. This is the this is why the in person odd one outs are great because when they have to walk out of the imaginary box, then you see just how upset they are. And you take that into consideration. I felt so sad being the first person eliminated. I don't know. Let me see that face. Let me see those eyes. I mean, I don't know about... Like, I can't look at that and be like, oh, that's a, a job well done. Clearly. <laughs> what it was. Uh. I'd like to know. <laughs> uh... I was like spinning there. I was like foaming at the mouth. Jesus. All right, I need a good lineup shot. Do you all work with celebrities? Or no, I have not. Influencers. 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 Okay. I know. I need like a line. Okay. I don't know what it was. I'd like to know. <laughs> okay. Let me see. I think. <sighs> Why does it always feel like the second picks are always harder than the first pick? When I do this. I think he's a makeup artist. I don't think she is, and that's why I picked her first. I think she is. I think he is. I think he is. You know what? I'm going to go Mariah. But I had my suspicions about Mariah previously when I picked prior, so. Do you work with celebrities? Or no. I have not. Influencers. Influencers. 
I've worked with okay, yeah. 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 I've never worked with a celeb. Oh, okay. Never. Who have y'all worked with? Not everyone but it, like knows her, but her okay. name's Yvette. She, she has followers. Okay. Yeah, like okay. about a million. So we'll most of you guys okay. are like YouTube. I just do makeup, like no YouTube or anything okay, like okay. that. Yeah. So, gotcha. I mostly okay. work with like exotic dance. I do it for the love of the game. And stuff. I don't do it for the popularity. Oh, yeah. oh cool. I do like weddings, stuff like that. So if people have events where mm. they can reach out to me and have me go there, then that's what I do. I hate bridal. <laughs> <laughs> I get this a lot since I'm like extravagant, like with like stuff and like, do people look at you and then like wouldn't want a natural look because they think you- Yep, all the time. One time I had like this customer, she like, kind of like prejudged me based off like my makeup. Cause it was kind of like yours, like really artsy. Yeah. And her daughter was like going to prom. And she's like, I don't want that. Yeah. And I was like, I'm not gonna do that. that. I always get worried about that because like as a male makeup. Oh shit, Google Fiber. I would say. I've, I've said this for the longest of time. I wish Google Fiber could tell that I have Google Fiber and then stop sending me adverts. They, sh they should have the tech to know. Hey, well, are they gonna judge me because they don't think that I can am capable of doing this oh, makeup yeah, that's and then just like, like yeah. i'm like please just trust the process like no, just yeah. make trust the process <laughs> what's like the average price of like a, a makeover if someone just wanted like a natural glam I mean, it like, depends I on the agree. project yes, i was gonna yeah. say like a hundred yeah. plus fifty dollar kit fee okay kit fee is additional compensation paid to a crew member for using their own equipment i'll give you a number maybe like Mm, 200 plus 100 dollar kit fee okay yeah, that's cool. <laughs> so i charge 200 just flat whatever yeah, 200 it is. but after that depending on how long it takes oh. i'll charge extra per hour and you oh. just do beauty yeah pretty okay. much i wanted to sound more legitimate but that doesn't really make sense that would be like a long time doing somebody's Makeup. Who's a makeup artist off the top of your head that you like, maybe not idolize, but you look up to? Vineal. Vineal. Manny. Okay. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. That was amazing. <laughs> For myself, probably like Kevin Aquan. Okay. I love Kevin Aquan. Okay. Michelle Fawn kind of raised me, so I, I, I gotta give oh, it to okay. Michelle. Yeah. I'm really big in like YouTube and like online, okay. so I really like Nikki Tutorials. I was suspicious of Alex. I had onions involved in my dinner, and I wasn't able to get the onion smell out of my hands, and I'm very upset. Because she was eyeballing me since I came in. When she Wait, what's she saying? Oh, I'm really big in like YouTube and like online, okay. so I really like Nikki tutorials. I was suspicious of Alice because she was eyeballing me since I came in. When she mentioned anything about like YouTube, I was like, oh, okay. There's like some <laughs> issues with you know people's backgrounds, so like it's hard to separate the art <laughs> and the person. You gotta shut up now. Yeah, that's what the buzzer means. You gotta shut up now. Oh, Alice. I was gonna change it, I stuck with my first guess. She didn't get voted out in the first round, so I just voted for her again. <laughs> Bye, guys. Hi. Bye, girl. I'm feeling sad, but not super surprised. I think that the tension got to me. All right, if you want to- She was just so play, nervous. Please raise your hand. This is the eye makeup challenge. You guys will have three minutes to put on makeup on our model, Darren. Hi, Darren. We will start off with Nikki. Can I hold the products? Sure, you can hold okay. the products. <laughs> okay. right, first one. You know, we would never normally use a liquid liner on somebody. <laughs> <laughs> I knew I was gonna get called first too, so I definitely had a lot of pressure put it's on music. me. Music production, I didn't have any match such a step up from the Zoom days. All right, the black is not pigmented at all. Okay. <laughs> is it gonna like rinse it off? Hello, my name's Aldrich. I'll be your makeup artist. Oh, he's doing the whole professional thing. I love it. For today, if you can just look down for me. Okay, if you can Aldrich, you have three minutes speed. The etiquette throw in now. I should have asked if you were allergic to anything, but oh well. <laughs> <laughs> Let's just pack on more color. Okay, so they're just doing eye stuff. 
I see. I see, I see, I see. He only has one eye, which is okay. And I know we only have three minutes, but I just want to see more from him. I have gloves. I came ready. My pie's not going okay. Could <laughs> <laughs> you imagine? Can close eyes for me, please? I told y'all I work with dancers, like they give me 30 seconds to do their makeup. <laughs> Oh shit, what is this? Bentley killed it. I think I did the best. I think I did amazing. Go Bentley! Today. So what do you do in your spare time? <laughs> do you model often? You have a gorgeous skin. What is your skin prep like? Water. Just water? What do you think? Water, water, water and soap. soap. You know, like, <laughs> that's it, I'm done. Okay, do you mind if I use my fingers on your face? Okay, I'm gonna try to see. I like the meta of like, hey, we're gonna treat this like a professional thing. I'm gonna ask you the questions I would like a real client or whatever. Try to seem more professional about it all. See if I can pick up some more pigment. It's a good play, whether it's real or not, you know? Ta -da. I don't know if I like that. Again, very uneducated, my opinion on this, but in three minutes compared to what some of the others did, that seems rough. Okay, so I'm gonna go for like a cute little- But again, I don't know shit, so. Graphic moment, so. I need a tapping motion, you know? That's how you apply some shadow. Try to outline this with the liner. Well, my hand is shaking, so. Gun, gun. Oh, you're giving it. Mm -hmm. Hand, uh, pencils down. That was really good. So I felt like that was like a good choice to do screen graphic. I don't know if maybe I did the worst because I was panicking. I mean, I thought George did the worst. So if we're just... Uh, to get rid of the competition. Have a tie between Aldrich and George. There he is. That means we're going <laughs> to a tiebreaker. Uh. <laughs> you're going to get 20 seconds to state your case. So we'll start with Aldrich. I'm a makeup artist. I've been working for uh, since 2015. I started at a haunted house, starting doing special effects makeup, and then oh, I a haunted to house start. Craft moved here, and then started freelancing. I've been working with OnlyFans people, so I've worked with Bella Thorne, Tyler Posey, Pia Mia, Kid Quill. And and I'm still trying to build up my portfolio. One of those names. One of those names that were said I was not happy about. I'm a makeup artist. I'll let you guess which. <laughs> so when I was growing up, it wasn't cool to be a makeup artist. So throughout my time and age, I had to originally paint my face inside of my um, room. And as I got older, I uh, learned through YouTube and um, all of my friends who are makeup artists. And it's really a creative outlet for me. I love being able to create a new... I think they're going to vote for him face for myself and other people. I love challenges. I love all uh, facets of the makeup artist. And I'm a makeup artist. <laughs> nope. Immediately eliminated. You spoke after the buzzer. <laughs> Get rid of Penalty. That tiebreaker had me shocked. Penalty. Like, oh, I'm out. Okay. Well, all right. Well, it was nice knowing y'all. I got the sense. I got the sense. His pitch was not as good. Hi, guys. We love you. We love you. We love you. We love you. I'll see you on set. <laughs> If you have any doubts and if you want to continue playing, I still game. really think it's YouTube her. TV has oh no shit, TV YouTube TV. Oh, hello. Hello. How are you doing? Oh, what is this an advert for? Oh, of course, Trem Fire. Gobbledygook. You're beautiful, but. Oh, they're going. They're going again. I like totally forgot your story and everything because you were really quiet. Mm -hmm. um, how did you start off? I just remember you saying you liked the Fenty artist and that was like all I got, I'm sorry. Since growing up, I've always loved makeup. So I started with family, friends in high school. I graduated around 2015. I worked at Mac for about three years. I'm doing makeup on people there and then started freelancing there. What lashes do you have on? These are by Dynasty. 
Been listening to the new odds. Looking forward to this one. I'm also looking forward to it. I've had now a couple people be like, hey, it is some shit's about to happen. So I've, uh, I think I've mentioned it on the streams, but, um, I've had, I have a friend, like an IRL friend who's also playing it. I think she's quite a bit ahead of me at this point. Um, but she's been playing and then watching my streams as I'm like behind her. And she's like, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> These next ones are great or this next one should be good. So build anticipation it'll be a good friday night stream i see cosmetics i don't remember the name but they're uh so there is this a re i'm using your own to story again oh you're welcome i'm glad you know it, it helps when someone says they see i assume that means e either you're saying like consistent like i haven't like just dropped off the game or just i'm actually reading the whole thing either way that's nice to hear. Like I said, at the very start, I, I wavered and I was like, should I, should I like, <laughs> should I not be reading the whole thing? I mean, at the very least, I just know that it is lengthening. That's the only negative I can see. Uh, it's fine. I'm used to playing games super long. They're like a yeah, you get to just, you just set me on the background. I don't need to be your main focus ever. On any streams. Uh, more of an indie, smaller brand. Do you have a PR code? Just put me in the background. I've been told on multiple occasions. My streams are best as background noise. It's fine. No, I don't. Okay. <laughs> no, I was just asking. Oh, what did you say? Around 2015. I, worked at I was too busy tooting my own horn. I for about three years. I've been doing makeup on people there and then started freelancing there. What lashes do you have on? These are by Dynasty Cosmetics. I don't remember the name, but they're like a... More of an indie, smaller brand. Do you have a PR code? No, I don't. Okay. A what code? <laughs> You're like, thank you. <laughs> no, I was I just asking. Okay. I can see the page. I can okay. see the page. I was just yeah. asking. I think it might be you because, I don't know, you're just so beautiful. I feel like someone else did your makeup. And then my... Damn, he's calling her out. You're kind of asking us questions, so we don't have a chance to ask questions. I was gonna questions. say you can bring back to me, but so, shoot away. Well, well can you give us like a like a rundown? Yeah, of first? course. Um, I started off in musical theater. I was a musical theater major most of my life, which is why, which is why she's like this. <laughs> which like I'm like, I would always help like the dancers out with their lashes and this, this, not even in theater. And again, like you kind of know about makeup in that way. And then I just kind of decided that was what I wanted to pursue. And what's your favorite part about being a makeup artist? Mine is making people happy and making them look like something that they never imagined they could be. I like giving people confidence that they don't think they have. Kind of building their confidence confidence as well, but just kind of like making their day. Because like sometimes just talking to them and not even besides the makeup helps build their day and you like know. a little therapy session. Yeah, exactly. I'm a They're gonna get rid of her so hard. Anything She's not as, lasting. Like, blending. That's why even like clean skin is my go-to. And a bitch just likes to create weird shit. Oh my god, of course. teacher. Okay, so yeah, can the mole raise your hand? Oh, that didn't work. <laughs> <laughs> That's the sad part. Now, if I, now we have to vote someone else. So it's like. But I know they're gone. You're I too know, late. We already, we already told to go to the next round. Again, I'm so sorry. Like, I'm She's getting <laughs> did her dirty, dude. I think she is a makeup artist, but she must leave the box. If the light turns green, that means you have voted out the mole and you win. If the light turns red. That means the mole is still in the box and you lose. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> oh, okay, so I still have a chance of winning by my own rules. If it's that one person <laughs> I said who did get out. I had doubts on you. So Will the mole please step forward and reveal yourself in three? She's smiling. She's smiling. Sorry, guys. <gasps> Oh, fuck. God, he would have been like my third choice, honestly. Guys, normally I'm what you paint. Did you do your makeup this morning? No, one of my girlfriends did. I but I can do makeup, but nothing like you guys. You guys are amazing. I was a I was saying, dude, he did such a bad job on the the intern that they brought out a little while ago. I was like, that just looks 
amateur compared to everyone else. Obsessed with your eyes, obsessed with your eyes, obsessed with your self. Uh -huh. obsessed <laughs> with your love. Makeup artists are the best people in the world, and everybody that we had here today I could honestly say I could beat my face. It was so much fun. I feel amazing. I thought I was gonna be the first one out because I didn't have any makeup on, and I was like, these people are gonna hate me, but no, I'm happy I won. All right, that's a loss for me. All right, two more. Let's go through two more here. Uh, six dumb wizard fans and a fake. The Pope's exorcist. Oh, they're dressed up. Holy shit. Holy shit. Okay. All right, we got serious wizard fans. Oh God. Okay. I wasn't allowed to read them growing up, and my parents were like, "We don't want you to become a witch." And I was like, <laughs> "Well, uh, it's fake." Um. We brought together seven Harry Potter fans. I'm a Harry Potter fan. I am a Harry Potter fan. I am a Harry Potter fan. God, she's trying hard. I'm a Harry Potter fan. I am a Harry Potter fan. I'm a Harry Potter fan. I'm a Harry Potter fan. This is gonna be impossible to figure out. I'm a Harry. Cameron's a Harry Potter fan. Harry Potter fan. I am a Harry Potter fan. I'm going to say Insong is a Harry Potter fan. I am a Harry Potter I know, I know, one of the people that dressed up as a Harry Potter character is not going to be the fan. It's going to be the most obvious try to, like, deflection. Gracia is a Harry Potter fan. I'm probably saying her name wrong. Butterfan. I'm a Harry. Star Laboratories. He is a Harry Potter fan. Harry Potter fan. I am a Harry Potter. You know what? I'm calling my shot. Rachel is not a Harry Potter fan. Fan. I'm a Harry Potter fan. That's my first I'm a pick. One is a. I'm I'm thinking that one of the people that dressed up is not a Harry Potter fan. Liar. If the group discovers who the liar is, they'll split a cash prize. If the liar survives, they win the entire prize. Who is the odd one out? I think the best thing to do right now is say your house and your patronus. Oh, that's, that's a good idea. Is that with you? Okay. The most basic thing. Take a quiz. What? What's your house? Okay, I'm a Hufflepuff. All right, I, I, I shouldn't I think talk the over it. Best thing to do right now is say your house and your patronus. Oh, that's, that's a good idea. Is yeah. with you? Okay. Ravenclaw, Otter. Okay, I'm a Hufflepuff and I'm a Schlup. She uh, doesn't actually think this is gonna solve anything. She just really wants. She's just one of those people that's really will just ask you. She just wants to know. <laughs> she just, in any social situation, she's gonna ask you what your uh, patronus and your house is. Hufflepuff and Sugar Glider. Ravenclaw, alchemy. Ravenclaw, red squirrel. Ravenclaw, <laughs> otter. Wait, he said alchemy. Now, I'm not a I, uh, I'm not a big Harry Potter person. I thought the whole thing about Patronuses were that they were like animal familiars, okay. like an animal spirit with you. Okay, he said alchemy. Huh? It's probably a thing. I just probably don't know shit, but like. Hufflepuff and sugar glider. Ravenclaw, alchemy. Alchemy? Okay, if it's not a thing, and he's not a Harry Potter fan, but he heard the other three give different animal examples, and then he says alchemy, then he's just really bad. Ravenclaw, red squirrel. Ravenclaw, <laughs> otter. Gryffindor, otter. I think I was most suspicious of Rachel. Her and I were the only ones that kind of came on full customs. Because I was expecting everybody would do it. So when nobody did, I was like, hmm. Who's read the books? <laughs> okay, next question. Who's seen the films? And they all raise their hand again. Oh, okay, perfect. Okay, cool. What's your favorite book? Third. Okay. Goblet of Fire. The first one? Yeah. I'd say the seventh. Who's imagining? I'd say Order of the Phoenix. I'm half Blood Prince. So, okay. okay. I was really suspicious of Cameron. He wasn't wearing real Hufflepuff gear. He wasn't talking as much, so I thought he felt overwhelmed with the amount of material. Wait, he wasn't I'm wearing Hufflepuff gear? Half-Blood Prince, so. 
Okay. I was really suspicious of Cameron. He wasn't wearing real Hufflepuff gear. He wasn't talking as much, so I thought he felt... Oh, I just now noticed her thing says Ravenclaw on it. About? What's the spell that Hermione said in the second book? I guess that baseball shirt thing might be a Ravenclaw thing as well. When he, she fixed Harry's, like, glasses. And his Star Laboratory is a Harry Potter thing? Oculus Reparo? Yes. Yeah. What boob you said? Second. Um, the amount of material we were talking about. What's the spell that Hermione said in the second book when he, she fixed Harry's, like, glasses? Oculus Reparo? Yes. Yeah. What boob you said? Second book. Yeah. When they're, a di when they're a diagonal. Oh, I know what you're getting at. It's not the second book. Yes, it is. Yeah, she does it twice. Oh, shit, we got a Harry Potter fan fight. Fight! They're fighting! And Oculus Trivia! Yes. Yeah. What boob you said? Second book. Yeah. When they're a di when they're a diagonal. Oh, I know what you're getting at. It's, it's not the second book. Yes, it is. It's yeah, she does it twice. He was like, and I was like, whoa, and I so I got kind of like defensive. No. Do you mean specific? Yes, yeah. <laughs> that's what I'm. Oh. Okay, good catch. Good catch. Um, For the two Ravenclaws, what are the actual Ravenclaw colors? Oh, um, blue bronze. and bronze. When you have seven people, one minute is not enough. Everything was moving so fast, so it's hard to guess who else might have been. Hey, San Antonio. No, Google Fiber. I already have Google Fiber. I'll say it until I'm blue in the face. This is impossible. You know what? They're probably going to eliminate this guy. Just because I guess everyone else has something Harry Potter related on him. Um, I'm going to have to pick a second. I was most suspicious of Cameron because he didn't talk at all. I knew it. <laughs> I would have voted myself out. I feel like I took one breath and then I was gone. <laughs> when did you guys start reading Harry Potter? Okay, I'm gonna pick for my second choice. I'm not gonna pick the other one dressed in full garb. I'm gonna say He's really trying to go the whole ask a bunch of questions route. He said alchemy. But no one said anything, so maybe that's a thing. Just sounds dumb. <laughs> just it just sounds dumb. Uh I'm gonna pick I wanna pick him or I wanna pick her. I'll pick him. I'm going to pick him just because he's going like, I'm going to ask a ton of questions so that no one asked me anything that I wasn't able to prepare for. Yeah, so I read the first book the year it came out. So I was Ooh. in fifth grade. My mom read it to our, mm. our fifth grade class. I didn't read the books until seven years ago because I was born and raised in El Salvador. So over there, it was just too expensive for me to get the books. With my first salary, I bought my first Harry Potter book, which was the first book. My sister was a huge Harry Potter fan, but I was like a little scared because I saw Voldemort and like, is this like a horror movie? Mm. In high school, I had a really, really big crush on this guy. <laughs> and he was a big Potterhead and I just wanted to really impress him. So yeah, let's go. Really I always love origin stories like that you get into something because someone you were into was into it and then you ended up just ditching that person and then you still stuck with it and fuck yeah all the let's go you missed turn the video off <laughs> i wasn't allowed to read them growing up and my parents were like we don't want you to become a witch and i was like <laughs> well uh it's fake uh, uh hufflepuffs yes who's your head of house uh it's uh, uh professor sprout Question for the Ravenclaws. What is your true mascot? It's, a, oh, it's an yeah. eagle. Oh. Um, for the Ravenclaws, who is our head of house? You mean the I founder? Mean, founder. founder of house. Is Rowena. Rowena. Now we need to question the, the original. Yeah, yes. oh, someone yeah, yeah. give me a question. All right, cool. What was Ludo Bagman known for? Oh, he's the um, Quidditch announcer, right? At the um, World Cup? Oh, no! My first pick. Looking bad. Oh, is that the wrong answer? I asked a question about Ludo Bagman, who's a character in the books who didn't make it into the movies. I was trying to see if she had actually read the books versus just maybe watching the movies or maybe just trying to study up. My heart is pounding right now because like, <laughs> I feel like I read so much fan fiction that I'm like, <laughs> you read fan fiction? Yeah, I'm like, what's canon? I need to ask you about that. Oh, did you read Isolation? Yes, of oh, course. Okay, okay, okay. okay, okay that's that's Isolation is a fan fiction about a budding romance between Draco and Hermione. Yeah, of course Great. I read it. It's a classic. And I have a, a question for you. Yeah, 
Uh, why you didn't brought besides your one any other like? Okay, uh, first of all, <laughs> Harry Potter apparel is so expensive. I didn't wear any merchandise. It probably like gave a lot of people reason to suspect me. His shirt was comics related. <laughs> the mole will for sure have a one, but what about the rest of the clothes? What is your favorite scene from the books? Like something that it wasn't in the movie. Oh. That's a good Loser mentality. Someone doesn't. Uh, oh, they didn't show up to the odd one out production with fucking a full Harry Potter garb, they must be the mole. Yeah. If everybody read the books, then they should be able to name a scene in the books that wasn't in the movies. Mine is when Dumbledore, uh, Voldemort died, because in the movies he died as, uh, like, the, he, he yeah, disintegrated, the but in the books yes, he yes. died as a mortal man. Uh, Ron and Hermione become prefects, and Malfoy does too, and then mm -hmm. they're like, walking through school and Hermione's like, Harry, don't go picking around with Malfoy. He's a prefect now. He can make life difficult for you. And he goes, wow, I wonder what it would be like to have a difficult life. Honestly, I think it could be the Quidditch final in Prisoner of Azkaban because there was no, that just wasn't included in the movie. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. I really wish that they include like Peeves, the poltergeist, oh, throughout yeah. the whole like movies, like he wasn't there. Oh, do you guys like Snape? Snape fans? Yeah. No. I hate I Snape. He hurt Petunia. He literally got her hit with a branch, and that's when he like showed effect. There's like, nothing in any of the books, any of the movies, that shows like that he wasn't actually all about that life. In both in the books and and the movies, I feel like all along he has Dumbledore's support. I don't know what's. I don't like Dumbledore. <laughs> He's a manipulator. I don't like him. He's weird. Uzera was talking so much. Yeah, all my homies hate Dumbledore. He is probably only giving all the facts that he study and speaking more so the rest don't get to talk. Oh, yeah, Dumbledore's a manipulator. He is literally, like, no, no, no. It's like, no, no, like, no, 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 I look at each character as if, like, they're people. And Dumbledore's background, like, with his thing with Grindelwald, so I feel like that makes him human at the same time. I can kind of relate to him. I'm sorry. We got a tie. A tie. The tie is between Kylie and Intom. That means we're going into a tiebreaker. Each of you is going to get 20 seconds to state your case. I think like everyone here would know the quote um, at the end of the book when Peeves comes out into like the hall and says like, we did it, uh, we bashed them. We Potter's the one. Moldy has gone moldy. Um, <laughs> Foldy's got Foldy. I mean, I'm a late Terrible. Potterhead, but I freaking love Harry Potter. I've been to like all the landmarks. I've been to Leadenhall Market. I've been to Black Park. I've been to the Elephant House, and I spent so much time there. Oh my god! And I've also been to Harry Potter World, obviously. I'm just a really big Harry Potter, and I'm just super nervous, and I can't think that's why I'm like so quiet and I blacked out. But no. Oh. Favorite book, a movie is the third one, but my favorite scene is from the sixth one when Harry Potter he yes. drank Felix like the Lucky Charm, and he's just walking, and then like Professor Slughorn comes, and he's like, Harry, and he's like, Sir. When they are at the uh, like dinner hall, and each is eating like in their house. I just have I have nothing to say to this. House, um, table. I'm just <laughs> I'm just watching. He, like he wanted to go. I'm forgetting her name. Then he's like, I wanted water for this. I was staring into that bottle of water. So he goes like. And all the way to like Cold Street because he's just so nervous because flooring with her. The first one, I just screwed it up. So I was like, okay, I have a backup. And I have another one. Harry gives Dobby the book with the sock and he mm -hmm. found this. He's like, oh, the master has give Dobby a sock. In Order of the Phoenix, the fight between Dumbledore and Voldemort is just crazy. Like, that's the only reason I really like the Harry Potter movies is because it gave me a way to actually see what I'd been reading since I was 10. It's like a flashback of James Potter and him like bullying. Uh, Snape and saying, oh, I'm taking down Snivelly's trousers. I think that's a very important scene to me because it shows that even though it's like someone to look up to, there's like flaws in every character. Deathly Hallows when Hermione has to obliviate her parents. It's so sad. But it's a very Gryffindor thing for her to do to protect her parents by obliviating them. She doesn't even know if she can get their memories back. The most suspicious person, I think, was uh, Grecia because she blanked out on a couple things. I'm not a muggle. <laughs> Too bad, get out of here. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> this is like <laughs> one of those rounds where you get rid of someone just because <laughs> they might be obnoxious. I did. I went in the whole effort to like come and I don't want to spend another round in the box with them. Like threatened, and that's why they got me out. <laughs> if you want to continue playing the game, please raise your hand in three, two, one. We'll vote one more time. In three, two, one. <laughs> Why would anyone change? It just mentioned her sister was a big Harry Potter fan. She could be wearing her sister's sweatshirt and using her sister's wand. I started doubting like Brian. He might be the least likely option, but that would be like the biggest gas moment. I'll do one last vote, and that's it. Three, two, one, go. Oh, oh my god. god. All right. I think we've never had a situation like this. Oh. <laughs> what can I say? We're magical. No Great. while we're away. No fun. One of you guys could be the moles because you guys wanted to end so you guys can get the money. There's no harm in just having another round, I think. I feel like we got the mole. All three of you guys have given some pretty like deep cuts. The level of material that we've been talking about. Do another about round and then just eliminate intense, him. But I think the mole wouldn't that will really show him. Out those facts so easily. I want to keep going because I'm just like a little bit suspicious and part of me is like I need to like have it down to like <laughs> the last survivors. I don't know what to do anymore. Let's go for one last round of votes. If you want to continue playing, please raise your hand. And no one change your votes. <laughs> okay, that's fine. Better not be anything like that. I will crucio you. <laughs> I hope it turns red. <laughs> Just so that the Harry Potter nerds lose. I don't have any ill will towards Harry Potter fans. It's... Oh my god. So when it turned green, I was like, alright, cool, we're good. I was like... I feel the I'm need really to point that, that out. To the end. I'm very proud of myself. I'm, I'm sorry, Haley. I voted you several times. It's okay. I was, I was kind of suspicious of you. Now I feel bad, obviously. I, I was suspicious of you because you're like, you know so much. I was like, odd man out to psych me out. <laughs> Will the mole please step forward and reveal yourself in three, two, one? Oh, no. so I was wrong so again. I am a Hufflepuff. I took I took the quiz, but my roommate is a huge Potterhead. I was traumatized by Voldemort's face when I was six in the first movie, <laughs> and that's why I just never went back. Considering that I've never actually read any of the Harry Potter books, and I only watched like two of the movies, I think I did a pretty good job. I, I stopped watching Potter, because I was I scared of the Harry face. Potter. I can already hear the haters behind the screen. So you haven't read Isolation. I just studied about it. <laughs> that I feels so really betrayed. That you did study and the fact that you brought a sweater props to you. He didn't, he didn't do it. So. Oh, I was gonna it's say. So expensive. I was gonna say. <laughs> I don't specifically think that you have to read the books to be a fan. If you do read the books, you are able to appreciate it more. I had immigrated to the United States at a young age. Harry Potter was like a place of solace for me, or a refuge. I was able to be part of something like bigger part of something that is like magical and like can take you away or distract you from like things that you're going through or like tough things i think that's why it has like a special place in my heart <laughs> i'm glad they're happy all right one last episode okay, here for the night Kendra from jubilee here. Uh, i'm trying to Thank pause so all right it's uh let's see what is it it is cheerleaders versus a fake Oh, I want to see cheerleading moves done. Hello, good humans. Kendra from Jubilee here. Thank you so much for checking out this episode. But before we get into this video, we want to thank Google for sponsoring this section of the video. Oh, I shit, Google. Guys, but I am online literally all the time. And dealing with all these new accounts and passwords can be a bit frustrating. So having one less thing to worry about is definitely a bonus. Thank you so much. <laughs> Google's password manager helps keep your personal information safe online with their secure password tools that protect your privacy. I'm constantly Google not to paying Google, me. And so there's a lot of information going through my head. And the last thing I want to do is forget a password, which is why it helps to have Google's password manager remember them for you. That way I can focus on things like casting people for our videos. Thanks for watching, by the way. You can use Google's password manager when creating a new password for any online profile or account and use the recommended secure password suggestion. That password is then saved to your Google account. So the next time you log in, Google remembers your password by auto filling it in for you. And if there's ever a time that you want to review all your passwords, you can just go to your Google account settings I'm or touching you can my visit chin a lot tonight. 
To take it a this step is why I don't usually use camera. Because when I do like this a lot, checkup, where you'll get now it's just on. Which is great because if any of your passwords are ever compromised, they'll prompt you to change them right <laughs> just away. I literally have so see many the habits I have. to keep track of just that I've created in the past year. And it just makes me feel so much better knowing that Google can create all these passwords, store them, remember them, everything that I basically can't do on my own. <laughs> how, God, we are over a minute and Google is still being talked about. You can learn more about how Google helps keep you safe online by visiting passwords.google.com. And thank you again, Google, for sponsoring this section of the video. Hey. T T A C K D. Oh my god, I messed up. Can I do that again? I'm sorry. <laughs> I need a do over. Oh shit. This place is magical. We brought together seven cheerleaders. I am a cheerleader. Di Diana has the cheerleader look. I am a. Alexi has the cheerleader look. Cheerleader. I am a cheerleader. Maybe? I am a cheerleader. Savannah has the cheerleading look. I am a cheerleader. Ania has the cheerleading look. I am a cheerleader. Hung has the cheerleader look, and I got to see him do his little routine there for a sec. I am a cheerleader. There's seven. I am unconvinced just based on look by Meredith. And where was the other one? The, these two in the middle. I'm going to think, yes, I'm going to say, what was her name? Meredith is my first pick. I am a cheerleader. 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 I am a Meredith. cheerleader. Meredith. Meredith. One is a liar. If the group discovers who the liar is, they'll split a cash prize. Again, I know she's nothing. If the liar survives, but you just got to go in confidence. Who is the odd one out? Okay, so names, what, what gym we were, and if we were base, back spot, or flyer. Yeah, I, yeah. My name's Meredith. I cheered for California All Stars for five years, and I was a base. I oh no, she knows her shit. I'm already fucked. I thought that Meredith wasn't a cheerleader because of her long nails, just because you're always fisting. So that tends to hurt your skin. Okay, my name's Anaya. I cheered for about nine years, high school and competitive, and I recently modeled for varsity. The spirit Ooh. catalog. Oh, that's awesome. My name is Hung. I'm in uh, Cal, uh, Cal State Fullerton Cheer. I'm still uh, currently there, and I've been cheering for three years, and I'm a back spot main or side. Hi, I'm Diana. I did high school cheer and collegiate cheer, and I was a base and a flyer. Hi, I'm Alexi. I did high school cheer. I did one year in college because I had to move back. I went back east, you know, California State University credits don't count. And so I did mostly um, tumbling, uh, tumbling as a coach. Under the pressure, I was like, oh my gosh, I, I have to like get in there and say something. But when it came time to me saying stuff, I'm like, oh no, I'm losing words. Um, I'm Savannah. I've done youth cheer like my whole life. And then I did one year of all stars at SoCal Select. And then I do high school cheer now. I'm a flyer, by the way. My name's Ellie. Um, I did. Of course, she's a flyer. She's so tiny. You just gotta throw her into the air. The high school cheer and all star cheer. Okay, quickly, your favorite thing about cheer? <laughs> the like, family aspect of it. Eating. Um, I like looking cute and working hard. <laughs> I like yeah, stunting. Yeah. I'm a sportsmanship. I like looking cute as well. Yeah. <laughs> I have no idea. Oh, Instagram. The Instagram votes. We have a tie. The tie is between. Alexi and Diana. Each of you is gonna get 20 seconds to prove to the others that you are a cheerleader. Okay, so do you guys want me to do something? Yeah. Like Go anything? for it, yes. Okay, so I'll do my, my cheer dance. It's been a while, so it's okay. okay. Go team, I don't wanna bang my mic. <laughs> or get caught up in the wires. I can't I can't go full force. Is she a cheerleader or a dancer? Because when she did that dance, it was not as sharp as cheerleader. Great, so I did mostly tumbling okay. cheer at the all-star um, athletics cheer gym. I was teaching the mini and the tiny, so I'll just show you what I was You're doing a lot of talking and not a lot of cheering. I'm gonna do? Okay. Okay. Alexi pulled out the back tuck and I got a little thrown off because I originally had voted for Alexi. Okay. She was impressed. Asserting dominance in the cheerleading squads. Sorry. <laughs> it was a little bit unfortunate. Everyone was wearing their cheer shoes or their cheer warm-ups and I just came basically like very normal. <laughs> the cheer round. Oh. <laughs> really? Can we stretch in the main? Yeah. 
<laughs> All right, we gotta stretch. We gotta stretch. It's only fair. Oh my god, I messed up. Can I do that again? A T T A C K defense attack. Let's go. Han did really good. His toe touch was really nice. I loved his motions. I heard like the girl was like gasping because like my toe touch was super high. To the G, <sighs> to the O, yeah, go, go. All right, let's hear it. Let's go, Bride. Woo! Okay, I'm dancing because I'm a little like a cheer dance because I'm a little too broken to do anything else. But okay. This is the most. Perfect <laughs> I have no idea what is. That. Happening. Oh God. Okay, go. They're gonna get rid of her. Oh, did I pick a second person? I didn't pick a second person. Shit. Uh, okay. So I picked Meredith. I was gonna pick her like originally. I'm gonna go. Uh, um. What's her name? Whatever her name is. I forget the names. But her. She's my second pick. Wait, who is the one on the far? No, I like. I think she is. I was going to say I like her, but that's not necessarily the case. I, I think she is. I'm going to pick uh, her, whatever her name is. So these two are my picks. ATK, the Scots are back. ATK, you're the leaders of the pack. ATK, attack, attack, attack. She's doing it. Attack! Woo. Mine's a little more simple. I'm just gonna do a heel stretch. Wait, can I do that again? Hang on. Okay. Uh, in my dreams, could I? I I am notoriously inflexible. This I feel like I would if I was to attempt something like this. If I was forced by like a machine into this position, I think I would die. I think my body would snap. Long before my leg got even close to like straight up like that. She just did the bow and arrow. It was very quick, and I think everyone else is really trying to show their cheer skills and did a chant or did their fight. If it ends up being her and I didn't pick her, even though I was thinking it was her <sighs> at the beginning. Gee, oh, here y'all go. Go. That's right. Unite, here y'all fight, fight. W, I am, here y'all win, win. Together, again, let's hear it, go, fight, win. Let's go Westview. Let's see you. The cheer she did was kind of more like dancey than like sharp. Ania, that was my other pick's name. Bad, bad picks guys, bad picks. You know, I. I was like, what I did sucked. So I was like, that's fine. <laughs> At least she... <laughs> you gotta love the self-awareness. If you want to continue playing, please raise your hand in three, two, one. Okay. That is <laughs> the light okay. hand reveal. Yeah. Okay, so like what competitions have you been at? I've been sharp, uh, jams, and like N NC. Yeah, like NCA, yeah. USA. American Grand. American Grand, Aloha, you yeah. see a thing. Yeah. 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 Favorite yeah. Polish cheer team, or like an uh, all-star cheer team. Holly Coed, for sure, 100%. Dude, Smoed, because yeah. I used to be yeah. obsessed yeah. with them. Oh, and wait, what was that? What was, was the cheer show. movie about? Or the, the, the show? show? Navarro? Or Navarro. Wait. Gabby Butler, she was on like the Smoed. Like, like, yeah, 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 yeah. I literally yeah. wanted to be her so badly when I was younger. and she like. What's the worst, like, injury you ever had like, oh, to still I went to okay. physical therapy for I, years my ankle so yeah. like I had a severe concussion and I'm like like a couple years ago I had to quit because of it like oh and like I passed out on the MTA stage a girl did a basket and I was behind her her the heels of her infinity shoes dug oh. into my head I found oh. Oh. the heels of the shoes dug into my head that's upsetting oh, to cool. hear Mine was a nose. Mine was, yeah, her nail was so on, like hand. scratch yeah, my yeah. nose. I was like, oh, cheer! Everyone always had a broken mm -hmm. nose. Everyone's nose is always crooked. <laughs> You're too flyer, right? Can't yeah. see like your like air vest, uh, air vest. Scorpio. Oh, I'm, I'm so not, not flexible anymore. But mm -hmm. No, you're good. No, dude, okay, like, yeah. Once I Sorry. Wait, do that again. Why are you not pulling no. your toe? 
No oh, shit. She's in Jordan. <laughs> She's not gonna crease with Jordan. I did feel like everybody was kind of like more like shifted towards this way and I was kind of like the outlier. So I was like, oh, I'm trying to inject myself into the conversation without like seeming too like sus or anything. I sus. Actually, my parent doesn't know I'm in cheer. Really? really? Yeah, that's why I didn't have my cheer uniform because I put it away so like I hid it hit away. It? And like <laughs> my dad threw it out. I was like, where's that bag? And like he said, I throw it away. I thought you don't use it. I'm like, oh my god, there's go one thousand dollar my oh. my uniform. Cheer uniforms are so expensive. Like, just like so all stores. Yeah. Do you guys know like what bows yeah. of London are? Yes. Yeah. We like added up like how much it would be for like the whole team, and it was like thousands of dollars yeah. just for bows for bow. that we wear like one, two dates. Two, it's the like, most expensive NCA sport. Yeah. And then, like, it's a like racket. People don't Stunner, think yeah. cheer is a sport because they think like we're just doing like yeah, in the like, sideline. Yeah, I don't, don't want to really get like controversial, but I feel like high school cheer isn't as much because you're not competing for anything. Yeah, depend, yeah. depends. Yeah. Depends yeah. on yeah. Oh wait, okay, there's like, like CIS. Like, so like I competed in high school Thunder and um, like Arizona cheer for high school um, when they compete, they're really good. I no. really don't think it's anybody here. So I don't think it's anybody here. Uh, I didn't think it was either of them though either. I did. I did too. I did. I was like doing like cost and lame. Yeah, yeah, I was yeah, like yeah. doing that. I was like, one of them did like some dance, like it's kind of dancey to me. That's why I was like, that's yeah. why I did yeah. it. Yeah, yeah, and like not as oh, sharp. No. Wait, oh, I don't like know. coaches always. Guys, don't vote for me. It's not me. Bum, 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 we went bum, to another round, so I just kind of went with bum. the person I thought was the least convincing. I'm sorry. <laughs> I just love how sad some people get when they have to leave. It's just very funny to me. Yeah. Oh, wait, yeah. I'm like a little sus about you, girl. I don't know oh, why. Which one? Which one? Like, no, no, I trust her. I trust her. I believe you. I trust her. Still a Naya. I don't know why. I just had like a suspicion. Maybe they're gonna think that like I'm just like kind of throwing on some sweats and kind of shout out. <laughs> if the lights turn green, that means. You have voted out the mole and you win. I'm not feeling confident. I feel like I've been off tonight. I'm off my game. Yeah! Yay! Yeah. Yeah. That was good. Okay. <laughs> Sorry for accusing you. <laughs> no, you're I, good. I, know, I always like, wait a second. I feel yeah, like I've seen her ad I feel like I, no, yeah, you look familiar <laughs> walking and I was like... Will the mole please step forward and reveal yourself in three... Two, one. No, I don't know shit. I was so confident she was a cheerleader. Oh, God. No, she threw me off with a toe touch hug. Oh, yeah. But it was kind of like dancey. That's why yeah, dancey yeah. was like. I did gymnastics. Oh. I, I didn't say this at the beginning, but I was like, the person they're going to get for the mole, they're just going to pick someone that's like a gymnastics person because it's similar traits similar upbringing maybe similar uh acrobatics for me cheer is very much about like teamwork and sportsmanship and like working together it definitely has taught me to be a very selfless person it's a way of radiating your energy onto others in the cheerleading world seeing a guy in there is kind of like oh are you actually a cheerleader so i have to like prove myself more that's why i have to do all this is that a mentality still people still have like a guy's in cheerleading and it's like, oh, are you really into cheerleading? Seems so outdated. This to help, like, make but. me fit in. Oh, that was bad. <laughs> Shit, that All right, there we go. Dude, under an hour, we've burned through three episodes. I, I feel like I used to be a lot slower uh, with that. Um, or getting through episodes, honestly, so... Under an hour, I'm an outstream. Great. Like I said, it feels good that they're back in person. Um, so, good shit. We'll do more episodes at a later date. At some point. Few and far between these <laughs> odd one out streams. But I enjoy just sometimes watching those. So, why not do them on stream?